All right, you guys, this one is always tough for me, but you guys requested it. We had to do it, of course. This is the house where Michael Jackson died right here, you guys, in beautiful Beverly Hills. This is the Homely Hills neighborhood of Beverly Hills. And here is the house. The address is 100 North Carrollwood. Here is 100 North Carrollwood, you guys, the house where Michael Jackson died right here. He was renting this house in Beverly Hills for $100,000 a month right here in beautiful Beverly Hills. This is the Homely Hills neighborhood of Beverly Hills. And here is the bedroom where Michael Jackson died. You guys, where he left us. That was June 25th, 2009. Oh man, rest in peace, Mike. We miss you so much, the king of pop. 100 North Carrollwood. He was paying $100,000 a month. Of course, his real home was in Santa Barbara, the Neverland Ranch. And as we mentioned, hundred k a month right here to rent this house. The house was for sale. Uh, and Mike convinced the gentleman to let him rent this house. Elvis used to live right here on the block. This is Carrollwood right there. Up here is Carrollwood. This street that we're on right now is Montevale. And Elvis used to live at 144 Montevale. But Mike's address was 100 North Carrollwood. And of course, the king living there, uh, Elvis, that is, definitely inspired Mike to want to rent this house. And right here on Carrollwood, I'm talking about, man, Paris Hilton, Walt Disney, Mick Jagger, Rod Stewart. So many celebrities used to live on Carrollwood. And all those reasons make, uh, made Mike want to rent this house right here in the middle of it all. Here comes the front, you guys, where they brought him out. It's 100 North Carrollwood right here. Here is the front gates where they brought him out, you guys, right here. Oh, here is the gate where they brought him out in the ambulance. It's 100 North Carrollwood, you guys, where Michael Jackson left us. Right here in Beverly Hills, the Homely Hills. Oh, rest in peace, Mike. The doctor prescribed him that medicine that his body could not handle. You guys already know. And there was actually a tour bus passing by as well when it happened. And before it even broke on the news, that tour bus saw the ambulance coming out of here. It's owned by a gentleman now named Stephen Mayer. He's an investor from some fancy firm. That's all I know. But uh, this is where it happened, you guys. Rest in peace, Mike. And we miss you forever. The king of pop. 100 North Carrollwood in the Homely Hills. Rest in peace, Mike. We miss you, man. It's Sunset Boulevard right over here. 100 North Carrollwood, you guys, is the address. Rest in peace, Mike.